Welcome to Permacall Memories Podcast. I am Lance, or Jelly, or Prince, as most Permacall people would know me. My co-host is Philip, or Any, or Any Fowl, as most Permacall people would know him. Our mission on this podcast is to explore our Permacall, a small community in the Kingston 20 era, surrounded by Marvale, Jerusalem, just across the Washington Boulevard. Patrick City, just across the Sandy Gully Bridge. And Arlene Garden became the epicenter for football or soccer, as some people know it, in the early 1970s. Permacall was also home of some of the most legendary entertainers and musicians of that era. I was still going to Permacall Primary when every single Sunday a triple header was held. One morning match and two evening match was played to a capacity crowd at the corner of Permacall Drive, now Kennel Drive, and Calvick Avenue. These teams, Patosi Rovers, Carawina, Asphalt, Covey, Elferto, and Dreads were joined, was joined by Marvel Uenden to play in the Permacall Ghana League tournament. And every ball in Jamaica at the time wanted to play in a Permacall Ghana League to showcase them skills as the first officially organized football tournament in Jamaica. In these conversations, we hope to capture the memories of players, supporters, and any member of the Permacall community, male or female, who want to come and share their stories. Your feedback and support will be greatly appreciated on whatever social media platform you might be listening. Thanks in advance. So remember to like, share, and subscribe these Permacall Memories conversations so neither you nor your friend can miss another episode. Thanks. Today is Thursday, May 30th, 2024. And welcome back to another conversation with Permacall Memories. May I do the lunch, our jelly, and friends? And anyone that was named to do. Joining me in the five period is my friend from my idea, my name is Primacal. And the man who started the Primacal member conversation with me. Philip or any or any foul. And he will join us later on. Also, during the conversation, it's one of the first ones to reach out to me from out of the blue. Once you made the first podcast and was a guest on episode number three. And I've been already a host on a number of these conversations. Andre Taylor Dampil, or John Dampil, as he's known in his Premier Call days. I should go back and listen to episode number three and hear Andre tell his Premier Call memories in his own words. And of course, like, share, and subscribe while listening to that episode. Also, join us for this conversation, Rudolph Thumper, Tony Kamika. And he has been a regular member of this podcast since he came and gave us his own Premier Call memories way back in episode 15. And you must go back and listen to Tony Primacard memories in one words. And make sure you like, share, and subscribe while listening. Our um, guest today is a namesake of a friend and a win old footballer from Primacard who is no longer with us. Uh, Our uh, guest was introduced to us, Primacard memories, by our previous guest, Tibab McNeish. Uh, and his yo. guest appearance on that podcast with Tibab, I realized that even though this man is from our sister community in Duane Park, uh, he has a lot of history about Kingston 20 era, including Primacall. He has written a book about his community, which is not yet published, which sounds like it parallels the football yeah. history of Primacall, where politics reared its ugly head and destroyed the potential of football in du- at Duane Park. But without further ado, Primacall members, welcome Howard Clark to the conversation. Introduce yourself, Howard. Yes, well. Well, well, good evening. This is a kind of momentous day because, you, you know, this is what the, 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 you know, May, May the 30th, and we have seen what does that mean, United States with, 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 with politics. Yeah. And, you know, politics has played a pivotal role here in the United States and certainly from where we came from in per- Pembroke Hall. You know, I, you know, although I wasn't born, in Pembrokehall, I was raised partially in Pembrokehall. Yeah, my name is Howard Clark, I, you know, and I'll tell you my background. I went to Pembrokehall Junior Secondary School, 1969 to 1972, and you know, 
it, it leave a pivotal role on me. Yeah. And, you know, I, I came to school in the United States, you know, and I, to do, I first came to do medicine with my brothers, but I changed and I did architecture. So, you know, you know, my, you know I, and then I went into the United States Army too, you know, so, I, you know, I was there too, just for a couple of years. And then I came out and I got a, 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 a master's in urban and regional planning. So I regard myself more as an urban planner than as an architect. But, you know, I'm happy that I was, you know, I was introduced to you guys because I said, Prembocall played a significant role, not only in my life, but also in the development of, you, 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 you know, you, you know how you know housing in in United States and so forth and you know you know hopefully I'll listen to the conversation and I'll show you, you know and, I, and whatever I can impart I can show you the pivotal role that I think Prembo called Duane Park Duane Park you know Patrick City and and those surrounding Kingston Twenty played yeah, yes, uh, good evening to everyone. Nice yeah. to have you all. I, I described that a Kingston Twenty historian, so I will leave it at yeah, that. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Introduce yourself, Andre. Yes, good evening. Welcome to the podcast, yeah. Howard. And yeah. just your introduction has me anxious to hear your story this evening. So I look forward to it. I was I moved with my family to Permacall in late 1961 as a, as a toddler and spent all my years in Jamaica in the community where I went to Permacall primary, on to Excelsior, played corner league, minor league, and just got my, my turn around the block in Permacall. I migrated to, to, to the U.S. at age 16 and been here ever since, but the love for the community has not waned. So we welcome you, brother, to this podcast, and we look forward to the conversation. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Andrew. And Tompa, Tony, introduce yourself, brother. Yeah, man. Good evening, good evening. Welcome, Howard. Um, Rudolph Tompa Kamika, or Tony, a lot of people from Permaca would know me as Tony or Tumpa, definitely not Rudolph. And um, so I grew up in Permaca from about age 10, I think I, I was there, and left in 1978 to New York. Um, but I've always gone back to Permaca while living in the States, you know? And Permaca is, for all of us, is a dear place for all of us. Played corner league there, you know, most of my current close friends are still Permacolites, you know? Some I went to George's with, and, but, you know, they, they, they lived in Permacol, you know, and stuff. So looking forward to have some conversation with you. Um, you mentioned in the last time we spoke about the different type of development. Yeah. And because I have a real estate background as an auditor and CPM work in that industry, it intrigued me. You know, some of the things you said. So I want to delve into that some more tonight and get some clarity of what we call housing scheme versus development, etc. All right. Yeah, looking for looking for the tangy tumper. Looking forward to the conversation to our trust me, because that's yes. That's why I have to so quick. But first question mm -hmm. that I ask you, um, why are you moving to Dwayne Park and how old you were? Yeah, well, I, I moved I moved to Dwayne Park in nineteen sixty four. So at that time, I, if it's 1964, I was like seven, eight, and so forth. Mm -hmm. So, you know, my grandfather, I came with my grandfather, my father, my father, my father, you, you know, my, my mother, my parents didn't, didn't marry. Okay. So, you know, you know, so, so, you know, my, so I live with my grandfather and my mama and so forth. My grandfather worked at a company named Canada Dry. Mm -hmm. It's a yeah. company, yeah. Yeah, a soft drink company, and and the best, you know, best ginger ale. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the best ginger ale. But they had some great variety of uh, 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 soda, and yes. that's all. And that's how that's how DNG Dennis and Geddes, you, you know, you know, got it, you know, you know, you know, got it into. Now Canada Drive was on was on what you call it, Spanish Town Road. Yeah, and that 
Spanish Town Road going down, you know, those were what we call the, the industrial center of United uh, uh, Jamaica. Yeah. That's a fort. And, you know, that was going to be one of the great manufacturing oh. in, in, in place, in you know, a hub. Mm -hmm. You know, but unfortunately, crime and so forth kind of dampen, dampened it. Mm -hmm. And, you know, you know, so it was 1964 I came to in, in a Duane Park, and that was the first phase of it. Premacall was already built. You know, okay. built. Okay, okay. Premacall was built, you know, was built, you know, from, from about, starting from about 59, 61, and so forth. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah we we'll get to that. But more ask you, so you come to Duane Park, which part is actually Duane Park you live? Because... Well, I live, I didn't live, you know, I, I, I you know, when it comes to the direction, you know, I think I live on the, the western portion of it. I live, you know, that was the first phase, you know, you, you know, just, you know, close to Ball, you know, they call Ball in Crescent. I live on a street named Bunyan in Crescent and Rosworth Avenue. They had, I live, unfortunately, the people usually laugh at me because I live beside what they call a, 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 they had a, a cesspool tank, you know, right beside <laughs> the do the, they call it the do the tank. You live on yeah. the west side of doing the drive. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, yeah I, I, I live there. I live right at the mountain, behind the mountain, and 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 and, and there. But you know, we, I, I laugh at the dude at, at, at that tank. But when I look at it, that was a great experiment, and I tell you why, because it showed that Jamaica was now developing, and they were building, they were building a community where, you know, they had everything together. You know, they were building a shopping plaza. Yeah, you, know, you know, you know, they were, you know, putting in cesspool tank. They had parks, different type of open spaces and so forth. Unfortunately, that experiment never, was never completed. Never worked, yeah. You know, yeah. you know so I, I came in the, in the first phase of doing the park when they built 1,100 homes. That was 1964. And that was um so what what inspired you to go up on this research or what you say you want to write about your community in Kingston 20 years? What inspired you? Well 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 it is it, the love I tell you two things. Two things you never believe it what it is. It is music and 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 it is soccer. Mm. You never <laughs> believe music and soccer. Because which is, that, which two other big things that we observed yeah, I mean, within Premier yeah. Park. Yeah, it, it was the same thing. And, and, and Sunday night, I was trying to. You see, there's so much wealth of information that I'd like to talk about. You know, that that this community, that our community had, Kingston Twenty. I keep on is unique. A lot of people don't realize it, because, and I'm going to tell you why it is unique. It is when. Jamaica just coming over independence and people are the new com emerging community. People were just emerging as lower middle class or middle class or upper middle class, Kingston 20. So people were leaving from country to town. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So they mean, so people were buying homes. You know, people had come out of, out of colonialism, slavery and everything and was coming to Pembrokeall Duane Park, Patrick City, and all those areas, and so forth. Now, how did they come about? They come about, I always said, because of one, one area. They thought, you know, 1951, there was a hurricane named Charlie. Mm -hmm. August the 17th, 1951, destroyed St. Mary and Kingston and a portion of St. Andrew. August, it was a Friday night. So after those places were were you know were destroyed, they said they have to rebuild Kingston. But in the process of rebuilding Kingston, a lot of the British subject people didn't want to go back and live in Kingston. So they wanted to go to the Ligony Plains or different places, and they decided to hey, let's build Mona Ice first. You know, I remember Mona. I New just wanted the first one. Yeah, yeah. The first community by, by, by West Indies' own company. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Marvel came before Mona? Marvel. Well, 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 I'm going to tell you how oh, Marvel coming. Marvel and Mullines Road and all those areas was that Marvel came about not first at the housing development, but at encampment because what happened after the hurricane, they had to find tents 
for people to live. Oh. So it was more like a tent city. Wow. Wow. And they start, yeah. And that's how they start building it, right? They start building because marveling all those places were were, were plum bush. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All of those places, yeah, yeah. So, you know, so all around that area, you know, they had to find places because people were staying at Up Park Camp and all those places. It was like a temporary housing then when Marvel was set up. Temp yeah, yeah Marvel was set up that way, mm -hmm. right? But then, but then, you know, some group of developers first started off because, you know, if you hear about the Cultural Revolution, when the Chinese came, nobody talked about it. But, you know, you had a guy named Choi Enlei and Chiang Kai-shek. The Cultural yeah, Revolution. Yeah, 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 the Cultural Revolution in yeah. China, when the people might leave China. And yeah, them man. leave China, Mom. and when they come here, yeah, yeah. and some group of Chinese came to Jamaica, right? One of our first architect, great architect, I can't remember, I think his name was Dennis Tai or something like that, Sai. And he's, he did some, some, some great architecture in Jamaica. This guy came around named Patrick Chung. And he start, they start buying up a lot of properties around the place. And in the process, the first place they get was a Porsche and a Marvelly area in Pembroke Hall. And the government then gave them the money to start building. But they start build as a development, not a development. So they, you buy, you get your lot, and you, and you may build, and the developer may come in and build three or four whole homes. You know, those people were coming in, you know, emerging middle class or lower middle class were coming in. Um, you know, so Pembroke Hall was one of the few places that really started. That started just like so it how, started. Just like how Evendale and, and, and Meadowbrook end up building. It, as a maybe, development, yeah. you, you buy a lot and you build from it when you're ready for building. And, and you build from it, yeah. yeah. But one of the first one them build was Primacall, but one that built to was one named Washington Garden. Same time like Primacall. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Because if you remember, and I'll, I mentioned a guy, one of the first, you know, as soon as you can, you could have make a little money, you start be, you, you, you leave from country. So everybody leave not only from country, but they leave from the pens. I mentioned that to you on Sunday night because Trent, you had place named Denham Pen. That's a Denham yeah. Town now. Yeah, yeah, Denham Town because the name pens really mean farms where they keep pigs and cow and goat and so forth. So they changed it from pens to town. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, that's why we have about Sly Pen Road, uh, the pens where you think. Okay, okay, that's it. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, you know, so they start developing it. But but Mona Heights was one of the first planned community. And, you know, it, you know, but that was made for the for the up, the up British subjects, the oh, upper middle upper class, class, brown skin. The St. Andrew, the St. Oh, Andrew yeah. people. St. <laughs> Andrew people. Yeah, that's yeah. The, so they call themselves forward. St. Andrew. St. Andrew. Yeah. Yeah, oh. St. Andrew. Yeah, Saint Andrew. No, Saint Andrew. You have pronounced it right, Howard. Saint Andrews. Saint oh. Andrews. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you know. Yeah. But 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 guess what happened? A lot of the, you know, a lot of people, you know, you, you know, came. It was not only blacks alone, but we had a mixture of Chinese and 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 Bombay Indians and so forth. Start came to as part of the middle class too. Because we had a lot of Bombay Indians were living in Waterhouse or something like that. And they start moving. Cockburn so, Pen. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. And then, so them come, will for them there, Cockburn yes, Pen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 He was doing good enough, but money became a greed and he started messing up. How did he start with Howard, if you remember? What year did he first out? Well, I have to look. There is a book that you need to get, and everybody should get it. It by, by a guy named Kingston, Jamaica, Urban Growth and Social Change, 1692 to 1962. He has, and he's the one who kind of pushed me to say, I'm going to write. His name is Colin Clark, off my name. Yeah. So could you could you repeat that again, 
the name yeah. of that book. Yeah, remember I yeah. Andre, yeah. Yeah, it's very important. Everybody. You have a copy of the book. That's all right. Wait, let me see it. Yeah. Yeah. I have a copy of the book. Urban Growth and Social Change, 1696. Yeah. Yeah. Now forget that book. Yeah. Everybody should get that book. It's great. It even, I think it mentioned Prember calling it too. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. It mentioned Pembrokeal when they started doing, but it, you know, but but Pembrokeal was not enough. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, what is the name again? I his name is Colin. Colin Clark. My, is my name say Colin, Colin Clark? Clark. Okay, yeah. all right, all right, I got you. Very important book. Yeah. Also, should have it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a good historical book to have, definitely. Urban growth and social yeah. change. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's why I brought it with me tonight so you guys could look at it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah and yeah, it, it, it's it's uh, about three hundred page something book. But what happened? So the you know, Prima call was 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 tighty tighty people who were living there. Right? I got, right? Start living there, you know, because we were just coming out uh it was, it was pre before independence and 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 after independence when Premacar start building yeah because, of, I, because that i don't quite know you know where the first house built at Premacar, but based on what i said i know mm -hmm. the house started built before it actually started building mm -hmm. after after the rain in 63 come yeah, yeah yeah after 60 yeah but continue on sorry sorry yeah 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 because yeah, 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 you know, P, yeah, but you, you know, that's why as if we can and you get a chance, go to Gleaner Archives and put in the name Patrick Chang. Yeah. And you'll see you'll see the lawsuit that they did against him. And just read something that people wrote about him too. Yeah. You know, say, oh him do you know. But he, he was a good because despite everything, a broken clock is 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 right at least twice. I did because yeah he he built yeah he built he had to start Pembro Call too but he built Patrick he went over with the money and built Patrick City which which is the adjoining city yeah yeah, yeah. was it so where where does Rima feature in all of this Howard oh, what kind of name Rima Charlie no the no, Rima no, the people may not have been Pembro the 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 but yeah. Rima uh, no. is, is the housing development. No, the build the builder that came in after Patrick. Because you yeah. did mention that Patrick left, yes. and then a builder come in, and then it becomes like a housing scheme now versus became, a development. Yeah, 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 it became like a housing scheme, and I think you know I didn't go too dwell too much in it because you know my concentration was more in Dwayne Park. But I think Rima and another there were some other housing development Tavares. Tinson, Finson or something Finson, like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were, they were, you know, called Tavares, Tavares. He, they were the deputy prime minister. His name was Clement Tavares. Clement Tavares. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. And he was part. He, his, his family was part of it too. And the Finson. Now the Finson is very important because you know people talk about J. Ray and Nevio, but the Finson too was involved in liquor too. You know, so they start off in 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 in, in building rum because if if you have some fin some rum and so forth, and then they went into construction and they were also involved in all in 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 in, in, in that development too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In, so in were there was there there that company? To Andre's question, was that group? Is that the group that became Rima, the group? Because that's what we understand. There was a group called Rima or something that built the housing scheme. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To what Hello, my wife, hmm? the, Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, oh this is. Mm -hmm. yeah, 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 that, yeah, that, yeah, that's, you know, uh, that's, yeah, that's wifey, yeah. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, the wifey. wifey arriving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, then I get to see them. Real. This is true. That's why I'm glad she's here. I can't get to see them, yeah. I remember bring up my picture. That's the way I thought. That would not look like criminal. Yeah. No, 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 no. <laughs> I can't. I want to bring up my picture them. I don't know if something happened. And I don't know. No, man, you're supposed to can't see. We know. You're supposed to can't see. I don't know. Oh. No, I don't know. Oh, you're not seeing your camera. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm not seeing my camera. Okay. Mm. 
You see what I did, Terry? I don't know what you are saying. It depends on what you're reading. Terry, Terry, she, same give you a break, even though you never live up doing the park. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, sir. So, uh, she uh, lived in Dwayne Park. She, she, she in Dwayne Park, yeah. She lived in Dwayne Park for six months. That's, I told her that I would never marry her if she never lived in... <laughs> right. If she never, <laughs> never lived in Dwayne Park, yeah, yeah, yeah. You see, I should come no, to man, if, she didn't, if she didn't live there, one day you'd have marry her. You were so in love. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh. Yeah. So, yeah. so... But, yeah, go ahead. I need, you see, like when you talk about the Rima, yeah. I need to, because they call me Rima Charlie. I told you oh. that. Yeah, where did I name the combo? Where did I name the combo? Yeah. Huh? Where did I name the I don't. Them? You never believe it. When, you know, we're in, in, in the 70s, you know, we, we, I'd go and start dance, you know, I love to dance. And there was this fellow named Junior Delgado. Mm -hmm. He the was singer? a singer. Yeah. Singer. yeah, yeah, he passed away though, Junior yeah. Delgate and his brother. And what we usually do when they have when they have parties, you know, I, and that's why I talk about Pembroke Hall, Kingston 20. We usually have parties where they play soul music and they play reggae. I would would go at the gate and dance, yeah. <laughs> yeah, y'all, 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 one of them, yeah. So I was one of them, yeah. So I was one of them. No, I had a I had a brother pass away. He went to live in a place named Junior, you know, he, to live a place in, in, in Rima in the 70s. Okay. Oh. So, you know, so from there, the, the, you know, my friend, when he usually come around, so come that, around to older brother, older brother, how old? Older brother, older brother than okay, I, okay, yeah, Junior. Okay, okay, yeah. okay, I got you. I got yeah. you. So that's why I got it. Didn't come because of the construction. Yeah, yeah, It's just yeah, because. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But but yeah. earlier and I, earlier I said oh that you say it's music and football inspire you for go for the research. Mm -hmm. What about the mm -hmm. music and the football that inspired you? You never get in it. Well, I'm gonna tell you why. I'm let's go to the, the soccer first, right? Mm -hmm. And it, it, this deals with Dwayne Park, but it was the same thing in Pembroke Hall. What happened was that in in in, in the early in the 60s, there was this guy in, 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 in Jamaica named Bongo Lee. And he said, we got to do something with these youth. And they start playing. In a, he set up this, this soccer thing. We would play soccer before the count, you know. I used to sit, I was too young. And I saw the older guys start playing soccer, you know, in the start playing soccer. And, you know, I love it. But what got me was that my best friend was a guy named was David Wrangling. Mm -hmm. His father's name was Ernest no, Wrangling. Yeah. Ernest Wrangling. We are still good friends today, too. And his father's still around. And so forth. Right, them, him, he's still about doing the park, too. Oh. He lives in the park. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. And he went to Pembroke Hall. The secondary school. David. Yeah, the secondary, yeah. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay, okay. Who that? David Wrangling. David okay. Wrangling. David Ranglin went to he, he went he went he went he went to Pembroke Hall. He went to Pembroke Hall Junior Secondary School too. Is he related to Ernest Ranglin? It's his father. That's it's his it father. Is. Ernest is his father. Okay, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So okay. so so David would get me into it get me in, he, he, his brother Michael. They play a little soccer. Mm -hmm. You know, and, and David and David, you know, he got me into this music thing. So you, you know a guy named Gary Khan? I know the name. He was over in a in, in Independence. And in, in he played with Linton on that team. Mm -hmm. Independent yeah, yeah. and stuff. Independent. Him, he's yeah. married to Ernest Wrangling's daughter. To, to what's her name? She's to, she, she, Ernie. She was a trade. She was a trade on the Wall Street. Um, what's, what's her name again, man? Isn't that She's Ernie? Talking. She used to go camp camping, but when I went to camp and six times, she was. Yeah, 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 cause I know what one of the, David's sister, cause Shana is on Facebook. Yeah, she yeah, she's a, she lives she lives up in um West Palm Palm Beach. Yeah, that yeah yeah oh yeah yeah man yeah man yeah she she was she's a nurse. teaching she, yeah she's teaching now 
Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So we were a good thing. So I, I, I didn't love soccer. So in the Sunday when they had corner league, I would be one of them. You probably so which didn't part, know. Which part of the match I play? Oh, what? Which field? They play, first of all, they played on, on Baldwin Crescent. So you have a field and have to set up the field. How that go? Uh-uh. How the field come about? Don't have to prepare the field on yourself? Or... Yes, we had to prepare the field itself. But before that, there was there was there were three fields. Mm -hmm. They had one out on on doing the drive and Washington. Washington Boulevard. Yeah, that's where they Washington have a parking lot. There's a parking lot there now. In front yeah, of the plaza. 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 On the other side of the plaza. plaza. Yeah. That was the first field. Oh really? And then and then we build another we build we build another field on Eric Avenue and and I can't remember Miss. And they call no, they have this cool thing named name Edith Dalton. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We call that field Trafford, Old Trafford from the English football field. Manchester United team, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. But when they look at we, I, well, I, huh? I want field where I don't tell them move out of the field and send it over to the school. So I want field to get too small. So yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, well, that well, I had a protest when they got rid of Trafford field. So what happened? The, you know, Baldwin Crescent, Baldwin Crescent was the one everybody had to use for corner league, everything, yeah. yeah. Her name is Maxine. Mm -hmm. Maxine, right? Yeah, top. Yeah, Ma I, I know her as, unless it's different, I know, because must be another daughter then. Yeah. Her name is Ernie. Okay. That's a, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But it must be the same person because she lives in Palm Beach too. Because yeah, when man. David when David come because he's blind now. Yeah. It's a family problem. Yeah, you know? because er I thought Ernest was got blind too. Yeah, yeah, he's yeah. blind. And Michael and David, they, you know, they're blind. But, but they love they love music. Well, Ernest Franklin is one of the greatest um, yeah. guitars in the world. Yeah. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. He's recognized as such. Yeah. So you know. I, you know, I love, you know, I was into music, but I was into soccer too, because every Sunday, every Sunday, I saw I would be there playing soccer, but I played scrimmage too, you know, you, you, you remember playing those scrimmage on the street? Yeah, man, yeah, you know? man, by the, the road, yes, yes, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. And two, two stones for the goal. Two yeah, stones yeah. as a fourth, and we play, and we play that. So that's why my book, I address suck because that what that what kept us going you know the music and the music and the and 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 and, and the foot and, and the foot and, well, and the foot it's for me that the same story from the car and the football i was saw them program that remember that football that was the main thing so yeah 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 but you, you never i tell you I, tell, I went into the military that's how i get to meet my wife mm -hmm. because i wasn't when I, I didn't play organized sports when I was in Jamaica, yeah. right? But when I went, I went into the army. And when I went into the army, I started playing, I playing soccer. That's up here and in the States, army in the States. United States, okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I found two things, two things I never knew. I knew I, knew I could play soccer because I was playing, I could, man, some great guys who could play. But I didn't think I was that good. Right. But I went and we and we were, and we win the battalion cup yeah, yeah. in Fort Bragg. And there I found out two things about me that I could play soccer and I could run. Guess where I get my run from Jamaica? Because 1972 we had to be running from gunman. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I run in, uh, I we usually run from the stadium going back. You remember walking from stadium back to yes. when, yeah, when yeah, the park yeah, yeah, purple yeah. car because yeah, I man. Yeah. Car, you know? Yeah, yeah. And the are yeah. reliable. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Because you remember which bus it was, 91? 91? 91 bus around the way much drive and to do in the park. Yes, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so, so, yeah. yeah, yeah. And and then 39. 39 of the world, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. 39 right. past Premier Call as a fourth. I have that in the book, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, the 39 book, yeah. And that played a, a pivotal role too in, in, in Premier Call. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, yeah. There were quite quite a few musicians who left, who, 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 who came from Premier Call too, you know. Yeah, man. I'm told that this guy named Louis Leckie or something like that. 
So that's from Bacano. Uh, DJ. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. DJ. DJ, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What mm -hmm. musician come out of Bacano? Yeah, a guy in, we have a guy in, in, in him coming named Peter Lewis. You know, he, he you know, he was from you know, them guys there go went to Permacal Junior Secondary School. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so forth. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So as far as you remember, um, oh, what what year did the Connor League, organized Connor League start at doing the park? And how much teams in that? Well, I can't remember you know, because after I talked to you Sunday, I start calling like my friend Peter Townsend. You probably know, you know. Peter Townsend, because he was one, one, was one of the best, you know, per person. But a guy who knows all these things, a guy named Ken Rose. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Mm -hmm. The great I mean, Ken Rose, man. Yeah, yeah. Peter, Peter Townsend was Peter Zebe. That two Peter Townsend, there was, you know. You have one, you have one, what we call him, fine youth. Fine youth. And, and was that Dread? Eh? No, no more than dread. Him put a, in real time like him dread, but him, him never dread. Yeah. The father that beat the crap all the time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Peter Towns and yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And a, a, a half kind of mixture guy. All the girls them like him. Very handsome fellow. So when, when they know? Where them they know? Where know? Him, him, yeah, him, I remember him, Peter. He, 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 live, he lives in, in Jamaica still. He never come up. Is he involved with the church? He can play organs? Or no, no, the I, no, I, no I, I don't think so. No, no, I don't think so, yeah. There's a Peter Townsend that's involved with the Scott mm. Kirk Church downtown Kingston there. Mm -hmm. You know, and he also was in um, hospitality, I think. Well, because yeah. I, knew the, I knew the two, Peter Townsend, them, because both of them played, played soccer, yeah. Right. So I'm, yeah. So, so I'm a team that I play award. Oh, Wait, wait. Well, I know, I know the team that I, I remember I and where the match I played. Where the, I know what match you used to play at the, the roundabout, the, the, the bus terminal, the bus stop. The bus stop. Because, mm -hmm. because that one make us into the them program here. Yeah. But most of the matches we played itself. We the that's match in Premier Call, right? Yeah, in Premier Call, yeah, yeah. yeah. We're full of match but we played. That was the same thing we had in the the Park too. It played, because was uh, and, and Baldwin Crescent. Yeah, but you should stop at Baldwin Crescent, too. Yes, yes, yes. The Baldwin Crescent near, near to the Duane Drive and Baldwin Crescent, yeah, 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 yeah. the post stop is too. Yeah, That's yeah. where all of the team then play. There was about six or eight team. You had, you had, you had Sherlock. You had, you, you had, you had one. You had, you had Selvan Avenue. You had Brook Valley. You had, uh, yeah, and so forth. You had. That's probably six or eight team, yeah. All right, so let me get to the book over because I want to talk about the book because your book will help you <laughs> express exactly what you want to express yourself. You, but, you, well, my book, my book is more about is not about soccer or anything. Then, no, 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 this is not about soccer. I think I think the whole culture more than about because your book, the title of the book, what the title of your book? Oh, in the doing the park, the making. And breaking of a suburban community. All right, talk about the making first. Guy, most of that will make first. Oh, you okay. describe it. Most it great, then as far as you're concerned, and then it breaks. Okay. Yeah, 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 God. <laughs> well, it, it breaks down in three phases. Talk about the, the making first. At some point, you did admire yeah. your community when you just go there. I, 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 went, God, yeah. love it I call it the golden period. Okay. But the first, the first word. I wrote in the book is it's all because of Charlie. <laughs> Did they call me Charlie when I was in Dwayne the Park? Yeah. You remember because I read my Charlie. But you remember I told you about that hurricane. Yeah, yeah. Right? August 17, 1951. Yeah. That yeah, yeah. And it damaged it damaged it damaged Kingston and sent me and quite a few of those parishes. And they had to re redevelopment. So they had what they call a, a a housing hurricane task force. Yeah. You know, rebuild by Jamaica rebuild by Jamaica. Places that got damaged around Kings. A lot of the historical building them in Kingston got damaged. But Kingston had got damaged three times. This is the third time it got damaged. It got damaged. One, it got damaged because of the there was an earthquake. 1907, R19. Yeah. 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 And then the, and then they had a fire. Oh yes. The hurricane, yeah, and then, and then Charlie, and then Charlie. So, what happened? A lot of those people who were living there 
get tired. I said them tired of living in, in, in Kingston and they wanted to move. So that's why people start move up into the Ligony plain. That's why I say I got a lot of my information from from Colin Clark, that book. Yeah, I say yeah. you need to get that book. Yeah, yeah. It do, it does mention something about Pembroke Hall Yeah, yeah, yeah. It that's why I say you need to get it. Yeah, man. Yeah, and so the first phase, you know, they come in and they come in and say they're going to build build you know build those homes and you know that to fi find places for people to to live and you know because a lot of people were living in in shacks as a food so, well, That's well, 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 so where you come from where you move from up doing a where you're moving from what you are you to live i live in a place near mountain view avenue over east okay okay yeah over east near yeah, near near to the warwick hill as a food <laughs> you know you know i live mountain view avenue I'm, I'm an Excelsior man, so I'm familiar. Yeah, yeah. And and in fact, my what what was the name of that the first headmaster again? Wesley Powell. Wesley Powell. Wesley Powell, Le, Wesley Powell. yeah. Mm. Wow. We we my 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 we, we knew him. You know, my you know, my grandfather knew him. Okay. okay. You know, Wesley Powell, yeah. You ever hear about a guy named Kingsley Cooper? Yeah, man. Yes, the Pulse, the like Kings of Cooper. Yeah. The attorney. Yeah, yeah. Mm -mm. yeah, you know, so all them, you know, so they were, uh, you know, you know, we, we didn't kind of know those, you know, there was some, fa you know, our family knew them, knew the Coopers, them, uh, and the Powers and so forth. Yeah. So when my grandfather leave, decides that they're going to leave from, you, you know, I don't, I'm jumping. No, I don't want to jump. No, I don't want to jump because I want to tell you how it was built. All right, go you ahead. know or what started it. Yeah, so man, go ahead. Go after ahead. You, 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 you know, you, you know, 1951. So about 19, about 1957, they start, you know, you know, start doing housing reclamation and so forth, and you know, they built up Denham Town. And Trenchstone here changed the name from Trenchstone to Trench Pen it was to Trench you know, Trenchstone. But they were still having places like Baca Wall. Okay. Right. Okay, that's upon there, that's that Spanish Town Road, on the south side yeah, yeah, of yeah, Spanish yeah. Town Road. Yeah, yeah. All, you know, so people were living in those tents. You need to look at that book and show you some of those places. So they had to move people who in you know those people who were coming people were coming from country and so forth you know, from that hurricane time and that to find places so people start moving up into the ligany plain mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i mean i start going to center people start kingston start losing population a lot of people didn't know that i start going to center hold on hold on hold on you have to make sure you clarify for people the mm -hmm. kingston and center are different yeah, because yeah. you see, when people are talking, them be a general, them mm -hmm. kings are at St. Andrew, I want for them, you know, man, they come from town. You know, mm -hmm. I realize there's a difference in the parish of kings are different than St. Andrew. St. Andrew, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Because you have to see when KSAC, that's why KSAC, that's here. Yeah, yeah Kingston and St. Andrew Corporation. Yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah that's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, you know, you know, when when they coordinated it as a food. So, so what happened? So they start. Resettling, you know, resettling the place from in the fifties, from the mid fifties, coming up with the resettlement, the housing resettlement. So the first redevelopment was uh, was around 1958, 59 was Mona Heights. Yeah. You know, you know, but at that time they start building, start doing stuff, and around more lines road going around Marvelly, they were putting up what they call in the park. People were living in in Upper Camp. You know, and they had to move them out. So they send them up into tents. Oh, up in that tent city for them. They must build some tent city for them. Tents are so forth. And that's why you see Marvel and all those era came around. And then, you know, I told you, you know, those Chinese said, you know, a lot of those developers came in with Patrick Chung. And I can't remember that after look, at my box. You know, he came in and started design, doing designing certain type of things around the wharf and so forth. And they, they built, you know, they start building Washington Garden. That was start building before Permacall? Eh? Washington Garden was just part thing because, 
you know, in Bonnie Grant, you remember Bonnie Grant? Yeah, man, he was the bottom of Weymouth Drive. Yeah, man, yes. That's yes. my Bonnie Grant. You know, he was one of the first ones to start making little money. And he didn't get much. And he start building his property there. And Prince Buster start go Washington Garden. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And, and, and some of the musicians then leave and went to Pembroke Hall because everybody leave trenched down. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, and you're right, because, because I say Washington Garden, up to today, mm -hmm. and I wouldn't buy into that in a Washington Garden. You know? mm -hmm. But the house, people buy the property, then from the people and no building at this. Same thing, no I building. Not yeah, yeah, that. yeah. Because Lee Perry, Scratch Perry, and all them guys, Prince Buster, all of them went there. But they also went to Pembroke Hall, too. Yeah, yeah. And I, I can't think of an empty lot there, Pembroke Hall. No, because, because people, mm -hmm. they, they, not, they still have empty lot in a Patrick City. I know because because you talk about the talk, talk about the difference there um or oh, what the difference between a development and and um and a scheme and a scheme. Well, yeah, okay. Uh, oh yeah, okay. did you recognize that before you start doing your research that there was a big difference between a scheme and a development? Yeah, well, what happened? You know, because I, when I heard this word, I'm a, you try to do a scheme. You know, like it's a little trick you're doing. <laughs> That's like it's sold to us in Jamaica. Like a Ponzi scheme, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's not that. The scheme come from is a British. It is it, a British. It's a British term, right? Because when when they talk about the, you, you might the other guy was my name, named Ebenezer Howard. They talk about the Garden City. So they were built, you know, they were built, you know, they were building communities in England, in, you know, those garden cities. So when they start building those garden cities and building those homes, they were building bungalow homes. And when they're building, you know, when they build 10 or more things, they didn't call it development. They call it schemes. Oh. You know, that means uh, if you go look, just look the definition, scheme means and uh, the criteria of, of making of an outline for 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 certain type of development. Yeah, you you the word development. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, yeah. So they didn't. So so when you come in, that means say you're coming in to do multiple multiple units. Yeah, like a, in a scheme. Let me yeah. try it. Let me try yeah, it. Yeah, that's what you call a scheme. The yeah. The scheme. I so, like you build up some ball courts. Yeah, 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 you're building, you know, more, yeah, more, yeah, yeah, more than 12, as you say. Yeah, 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 yeah. Of, of, of similar floor plans. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, now that, you know, you know, and that came from the, from the guy with name, the name Ebenezer Howard. He came with the Garden City, you, you know, that's a, you know, and the Garden City is a nice area. That means a person come, you have your house, and then, you know, within the house, you know, you, 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 you can plant your garden, you can have your picket fence, you can have that thing. And that's the same idea at the garden city, Ebenezer Howard come, they use it in New York with Levittown. Yes. Right. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. So forth, you know? So when, when, when they build Mona Heights, they were, you know, it was built as one of the first housing schemes. And Mona Heights was a scheme then? Yeah, it's a scheme. Okay. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. So they built Mona Ice, and it was the, the government gave them the money to do to build to build Mona Ice, and you know, in it was done by by Westin, his own company, and that's and the Matter Lands, under the Matt Aaron Moses Eli, and a guy named John Heron. Those were the developers, mm -hmm. some Jewish guys. Now Levittown, what Levittown followed the same thing. If you look at the time it was built, it was the same time. Nobody don't put two and two together and look at Israel when they were built. When they were building, you know, they the development. Them, the second them at the time. The yeah, second yeah, 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 yeah. Shabbat. So, Shabbat. Yeah, so, so you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, so the, it's the same. It's the same old criteria. You know, Levittown as a whole, and it's the same. And they and use them the same one come and build Florida, you know. Eh? The boys yeah. them from Levitt come and start doing When you say Levittown, you're talking about Levittown, Long Island? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's them same one, you know, Dre. Them same yeah. one, mm -hmm. Levitt, they, they're the same one that came to Florida and did a lot of those. That's so why I love it. Levitt, the East Coast. Levitt, that's TR 11. Which one is it? Okay. Two T's at the end. Levitt, okay, mm -hmm. okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So when, when you look at how they do Florida, that's why you have so much active... 
before the active adult community was just the retirement communities mm -hmm. that they built, mm -hmm. you know? Uh, yeah, okay. those are, those are, they came here and did that. And so a lot of Jews were builders yeah. and still are. And still, still are, are yeah, a lot yeah. of the builders here. Lenar, Lenard Miller is a Jew. Yes. The guys that I work with at Minto, Jews, GL yeah, Homes, yeah. all of these. Yeah, that's, that's why we said Minto, yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. yeah. They came in and they did that. And the same, yeah, it's the same thing they did, yeah. So after, yeah. I, I, after the bill Mona now, Howard, it's like, the, what, what come after Mona? Have a view. Okay. And that was a scheme again. That was a scheme. Scheme, yeah. Bill same, that the same was, the man, what's in his home contract, that same way. What's in his home. And that was successful. And I said, oh my God. And they were getting people to move in and those places. But you know who, hey, you, you know how you could get those homes? If you broke pocket, you can't get those homes. You have to have a job. Yeah. You have to work. You have to work. And that's why I tell you, so if you look, yeah. So if you notice some of the people them who, 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 who they live in uh, Arbor View, some of them work, uh, work anyway, they have a little factory them with a teacher or something like that. Working that, like, class people, them, yeah. Working class people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My grandfather, they work at Canada Dry. Some people work at Denos Gazdis. Some people work at, at them they have a, a place, the name Nutriment. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Burned down. Yeah. Yeah, so those people, that's all you get, the job. That's all you get, but the you job. Could, you could tell, you know, I, I remember mm -mm. I hated being at home. Mm -hmm. If I if I feel sick and can't go to school, I hated it because yeah, you're alone, they're warm. Parents mm -hmm. gone, all of your yeah. friends them gone to school. Mm -hmm. You know, because the parents gone to work. Everybody mm -hmm. gone. So hold on, hold on. Let me ask you something. Let me, let me ask you a troublesome question. Can you say you have to work to get a house? Mm -hmm. Is there another way to get a house? You cannot do work in and get a house? Because because this is where mortgage this is when they come in with the word mortgage. You remember, you have to pay a mortgage. Yeah, man, my mother and father have to pay a mortgage, but them they are work. Yeah. They have to qualify and all them things there. Yeah. And that's what, but you see, this was uh, organized, you know, where you come through, through the West Indies own company, and they were doing the mortgage you know, company. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm going to, because I'm going to differentiate what a developer is. Yeah. <laughs> the brother in law called me, we can't talk to him now. <laughs> hey, hey. Hey, I want listen to this song. You hear this? You hear, you hear it? Yeah. How would that? That's hey Peter. I'll call I'll call you back, Peter. Alrighty. <laughs> Very important. That's why I love music. God, that's what I want right. That's Tom Bell. Oh, from Philadelphia. Philadelphia. You know that's a Jamaican. Yeah, which one yes. of Jamaican music live? I, I, I'm on commentary, but I've, I've heard it before. Where Jamaican music live? Me no know. And him left early. He man think that. Yeah, yeah. And them, and them run Philadelphia songs. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah songs yeah. of Philadelphia, yeah, TSOP. When Philadelphia run the music in the 70s. Yeah, yeah, him write, him, him write some of the movies. Leon yeah, Hoff and Gamble. Go for yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Gamble yeah, yeah, and Hoff. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm black off, but he must be a lady named Linda Creed. Linda Creed, yes, man, bro. white lady. Bella and Linda mm -hmm. Creed. But, yeah, but he, but he, 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 yeah, man, he, but he write that music, you know? Yeah. You listen to it? Yeah, yeah. He's a job, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so that's why I'm into music. I've heard that I remember before, I've heard that before, so yeah. Mm. It was another Jamaican, yeah. Yeah, but there's another Jamaican when nobody no talk about. Who that? And she was privileged, well, Privitual in in a in a making a, in a thing you know her name is Susan then pass. Yeah man from from Motown. From Motown, when them organized with the Jackson Five and all them things there, eh? she she's still was big organized. right now. She's still I think she's still in a one of the major organizations still. Yeah she's still in that thing. Yeah she's still in but a Jamaican. But guess what happened when them come up here you now? Them not let nobody know that them a Jamaican. And bail them because people usually laugh at them with them accent. Because if you ever listen to Tom Bell, him tell you where him father, where people see, see him father open him mouth and him start talk. Them laugh at him. 
when them know them not laugh at us, everybody want to talk like us now. Yeah, 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 you yeah, know? yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know another lady named Sylvia Robinson. Sylvia Robinson. She was um the, with the Sugar Hill gang. And she Sugar was Hill. and she and she did yeah. the Sugar Hill gang and 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 did yeah. the uh, yeah. Rapper yeah, Rapper yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Island person that you know. Yeah. I'm I here to the earth. So I really she did the song, the pillow talk. But I'm a talk and them things, yeah. But but she was behind the group with name Moments. Moments, yeah, man. She was yeah. Moments. Yeah. yeah, I found love on the two-way street and all them things. So mm. we have influence, we have influencer going, but them, them know say we have island. Yeah. They with all another guy from, from Jamaica. You know, my friend, brother named Migo was with a group named Brass Construction. Yeah, man. Yes, man. <laughs> And so forth, you know. <laughs> BT you know? Express. Yeah, and BT Express too. With, uh, yeah, and them have Jamaican, and them, them make nobody know to them Jamaican. Them just hide it. Well, you see, you know, so, Jamaica so, brand, mm -hmm. big iron, you know, how hard? We're not free mm -hmm. night, you know. Yeah, up here, up, up here, foolish is where I'm playing. No, 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 that's not that. The name itself, we're not afraid. The brand. The, the brand, brand itself, no, not the music. No, yeah, yeah. 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 May I add one of the music, you know. I stopped listening to the music a long time, so may I add one. Mm -hmm. Because me, I want to ask about a, a musician one day, a current day one, and I couldn't identify the name so far. <laughs> but as simple as you said, you know, oh, well, there are some <laughs> other ones that we know and don't <laughs> know them so big, you know. You see, you see, you see you have man, what, like Sly and Robbie, for instance. <laughs> when you look on some of them rock albums, you know, and them things, then you look on the artists, them up. Yeah, man, them man, them the, yeah. man, the, and, 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 but in a time, really, I, one of my friends who, you know, he, he, he was with a da dance group. You know, shut up on a car, you know, I talk about the channel, Andre, and we have all that memory for this, you know. Mm -hmm. um, Michael London. <laughs> Boy, is he? Yes. Michael London? Yeah, man, you may have him for the program. Boy, is he? You have a number, man. Yeah, Michael London, no, eh? Yeah. Tell him, say how. You know him? Him got from eh, eh? Yeah, you see my from car, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, what? Yeah. Oh my, he said, oh my Michael, God. Michael, they call Boise. A Boise, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The, co the courts, the courts, let me run the courts, and. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. more, him, him, when you listen to the film story, man, him have, him have, he was a businessman, an entrepreneur, per se. He never, he never put himself in a one car, not at all. He do everything. He do everything. Yeah, you, you know, yeah, I did drama to him. Yeah? Yeah, I, that, that's what happened. I did, when I went to college, I did with him the poetry and, you know, poetry competition and so forth. They, they said the other thing, I went up there, I said, I'll do some poetry competition. And I went with, I went with the school, with my school and I got on and I did, I, I, I did a little acting and drama and so forth. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. yeah. Where you go to school in the US? Yeah. Huh? Where you went to school in the U.S.? I, 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 you know, I, I went to Texas Southern, and I went to University of Houston. Oh, okay. So you're Texas. Texas. Okay, Texas. okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but, but, mm -hmm. but, but, but I went, but I went, go, go back on track, go back to the part, no, doing the part, the making and the breaking. Okay, the yeah, part. yeah, so, 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 so what happened? So after they built Arborview, they yeah. decided they're going to build, they said, they said, it's successful. They said, let's plan do a master plan community and they decide to do Dwayne Park. So that was a, that was one of them that were going to do a master plan community in Architectural Digest in 1964. I have an article about doing a master plan community. So hold on, hold on, hold on. So, so Permacal wasn't part of the plan at all then? Permacal is a private No, no, but it's business. different no, developers' no, no. land. Oh, I got no, you, no, I got you, I got you. Yeah, man, okay. It's Matalan, Bill Harbour, and Doing the Park, but, but it's yeah, Rima, yeah, yeah. the Permacal. Mm -hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. It, it's call. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm-hmm. You continue, oh, don't make a distract it. The side track it. No, right. no, no, no. That's good because they are filming. Anyway, though, is that so they, they decide so they're going to build 1,100 homes. Yeah. Right? In the first phase. And they were going through and parliament gave them the money and they built 1,100 homes. was six successful, 1964. But I don't want to leave with something. It started by Donald Sangster. Mm-hmm. Right? But he never lived to see it because he passed away. And and T- Clement Tavares was supposed to be the prime minister and he passed away too mm-hmm. within a short period. Mm-hmm. Too. So Hugh Shearer took over. And they built and they built they built eleven hundred homes in Dwayne Park. So between nineteen sixty four, right? And nineteen sixty eight. You know, that's I call it the golden period. Mm-hmm. During the park was the greatest thing. They were building those homes and people that I, I use the term had a sense of place. Because because people start, you know, you know, start building and hiding their fence and they didn't do an addition to the homes at, at that time. At that time. Yeah. yeah, but you know, you know, they were planting trees. People were going to Hope Garden and looking at the different type of flowers and bringing it back. To plant in the homes and so forth. And the first development, which part are doing about that takes place or what? Fun. For, the, the first side, Yeah, the west side. Yeah, the west side. They build around Dwe, around Dwayne Drive, Washington Garden, a place they call Selvan Avenue, Mays Avenue, and just around where the school is. Yeah, that's like the primary Avenue. school. Where the primary yeah, school that's is. That's the one man also there, Wallace Avenue. Yes, yes. Yeah, what? Well, yeah. So that's the first home they start build. And then they start, but what happened? Where I live was where they had to do the tank. The, in a sense, yeah, they do the tank. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, they, 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 they were going to build there. But when, because things were going on, you know, people started acting for it. They start adding more homes. And they build, they put, they build my house and another house right beside the do the tank. Couple, couple little Black. yards away from it. No, no, what get me so angry? Cause that's why I spend my time out didn't stay home. Because on Sunday the worst days to be home. Because then everybody's home. Everybody has flushed tiling. Everybody has flushed tiling. So you smell everything. <laughs> Especially Ted Rose. But anyway. Anyway, so that was the first phase, eleven hundred ohm. Yeah. So it's very important when I tell you the making. So that was a great time. That was the time everything was going great in a Pembrokeal too and doing a park. You remember they usually under Washington Boulevard they usually have Janku, no? You remember yeah, that? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, yeah drive yeah, come yeah. down and so forth, you know, because independence had just come and so forth and people were celebrating. So, Shira come in when Shira come in and say, hey, we need to build some more houses. Right? Because they, they, there's a need. And I said, after, you know, so the, but the people who come in were paying mortgage. They said they're going to build build terrace homes now. Those are two and three story homes. That's how Sherlock Christian come in. That's the second phase. That start the breaking of it. That's why doing the park have two story and, and everything there. Okay. Yeah. And that caused the breaking because the people who come inside there now never want to pay the mortgage. Right. You see what I mean? So yeah. the first phase people were paying, the second people didn't want to pay. Oh, is that different? Is that different it, brand that people come in then? Different brand because it wasn't people from factory. You know, who are, you know, anybody could come in and start, but a lot of them were still people who who had job, right? Yeah, well, so that yeah, wasn't yeah. bad. That wasn't bad. You know, with that first fade. That's all then I got, that's all I got like, just before the housing crash in that 2008. What them call yeah, yeah, yeah. Trump, huh? Ninja loan them, no income, no dax. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 2008. My, my wife is an accountant, you know. Yeah. My wife is an accountant and she 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 got a job because she worked with a company, mm-hmm. Yeah. 2008 when she lost her job too, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, but so she was an actor. I'll never forget that too. So the, so hold on, hold on, hold on. So the people were moving at the new development now. The terrorists, as they call it, mm. them never qualify them for mortgage, or it never matter at all. It never matter because there's more politics no, because uh, because yeah. the okay. sheriff, we have to get it, we have to get this thing because normally you know when the first phase really started, it was started by Norman Manley. Yeah. Yeah. You know, a lot of people don't know because now man, man, they live in Amona Heights. Yeah. You see? So man, he was kind of progressive. So he said, okay, we build, we build middle class for Arbor View. Let's build some middle class for, let's build some middle class again in a Dwayne Park. Yeah. Now, but, but then, but, but then, but then Shira came in. And when him come in now, you know, as a foot, they start changing stuff. That's why that's why do the part mix up of labor right and PMP there. Labor, yeah, because Shola Crescent is labor right. Mm -hmm. Right? And 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 where is PNP. And group yeah. PNP, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And, 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 the, and the original the original segment was no PA. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The making part yeah. of do the part. Nobody never knew about nobody politics at all. Yeah, it was no politics. Yeah. So I'm going to show you, that's why I'm going to show you, so the making and the breaking. That's a man said, I wasn't supposed to write the book, right? <laughs> so the thought some of says is that when Sherlock Christian come in, it wasn't bad, that it wasn't that bad, right? Yes, there were JLP, but you know, everybody right. does that stuff. Right, yeah. But, right? but when man look come back in 1972, right? Him come back in now, him said, why? We need more housing. And them say, you know, them say, okay, we are gonna build and then build Brook Valley. P and T. I mean two on the spalling. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> two on the spalling and then build Brook is, Valley. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's why we use the word the Brook Brook Valleyization at Dwayne Park. <laughs> and then man they come in and them have, they have an article where people don't want pay rent. Say, oh, you want me pay rent? I pay somebody some man I live a house and I want pay. A man start capture houses. You see what I mean? Yeah, in a Brook Valley. Yeah, yeah, and then yeah. start capture house. It doesn't matter if you live if you live in a jail that kind of thing. So all those stuff go on. A bad thing around the place, and I know how what? Mm -hmm. A bad man thing around the place. I know Margaret. Bad man start doing the thing. So it didn't look cute to me when me cause me was young because my my brother, God bless him soul. No, him, him passed away now. You know, my my father. In, 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 in junior, that's why I'm mean, giving them to give me the name Rima Charlie. Yeah, because if deliver in a junior, deliver Rima and so forth, you know. And in, in, you know, so you know, so so when you look at badness, thing you usually go around like me, a bad boy, too, right? You like it, you know, just like a young kid, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, yeah, me never yeah. Nice, you know, but what happened, you know, I see the consequence, yeah, me never see it. But what happened was that. Although me go like I was a bad guy, I was a book guy. Me love reading those stuff. So that's why Tibab talk about me because me start teaching, me start read, me start read some stuff now and because me that listen to the Rastafarian thing. I'm say something, something is missing out because me start read stuff about history and things and so forth. And Mr. Teach Tibab them say, you have to love science and all stuff and you know and 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 take up and physics and chemistry and all them stuff. We have to learn them stuff there. So what happened, you know, when we see we start notice a difference in the doing the part that when we play soccer now, we have what we what you have to see over one side of the, the field and then another man over the other side. Because right. and this is a violent yeah. Someone tell me one 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 part of one side of the field and then the other right. side of the other. Yeah. 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 Well, well, we play corner league, yeah. And then if a man kick a man, a man run on the field and all kind of fighting. Oh yeah. And then then you remember man like we start to see bad man come, my papa tree card, fed a map, everybody where you look. You see, all kind of good man, bad man come from feel, yeah. That did worse than from a car, sorry. <laughs> mm -hmm. We like to that from a car at all. 
No, because, because we were more all uh, PMP for the most part. But I'm yeah. well, uh, so we are so I'd log man. Yeah, but 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 <laughs> <laughs> and then that's the answer, even before that, you know, Purple Carl was never divided that way. Then it was like, no. but, 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 oh, what I say now, do the part divided that tree, you know. Mm -hmm. Right, because that's two different parties. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, no, the, party the original left. people then, who just in you know, a no party, Mikko Clark, and said that the, the original people come from 64 to 68. And then mm -hmm. after now you come in, one party, and then mm -hmm. Primacal never got at all. There's no, no way me could have looked from Primacal and identify so that section they are P or J. That what? never happened at all. But Primacal, me here, they have some written name, they know some communists. <laughs> Come in here, that you know. Yeah, but we're not. We have communists, but we're not have the other side. No, we're not. We're not. No, we're not. <laughs> one side. We're one no, side. No, 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 because we know one more intellectual. Yes. Yeah, because but because me usually that's all. That's all me start, you know. Cause me start learn politics and start because me don't like the intellectual thing. We can't talk politics and what is. That's why me didn't know about what are going worldwide because you know we gotta talk with. Me have, me have a guy named Owen Dwyer. Him they live right at Marvalley. And him, 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 all them girl him was Primacal. Yeah. Why, why you just say about Primacal girl again? Lord God, them pretty men. <laughs> they not some pretty girl, man. Live a Primacal, man. Then you have a girl named, you have a girl named, a girl named Ursa Young. Yeah. Yeah, Ursa Young. Sharon Pineda. Doreen mm. Carty. Lord God. Yeah, yeah. Then, then I, I'm, I, what happened? Because I could have draw. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm draw again. You see, what, just... you, you see what, <laughs> what happened when I was writing? Right? Because I listen to you now. Mm-hmm. It's a promo call now. Mm-hmm. The only way I can find it is that promo call never the it. It's like, as, 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 as Andre and Tom are saying, I want to set a man to do it. I don't want to say I want to. I, I think what it happened. Intellectual, the man of the side up. It never affect the politics, never affect the community of Primaca. It affect the football. Mm. That's the only thing it affected. It never destroyed the community at all. Thanks for listening to part one of this conversation. Make sure you subscribe to Primaca Memories YouTube channel so you don't miss part two of this conversation as it will go directly to your inbox once you subscribe to Primaca Memories YouTube channel. Thank you. Thanks for listening to Permacard Members Podcast. And remember to give us all the support you can on whatever social media platform you are listening. A special thanks to my production manager, Cameron Wright, who takes you of everything in getting the podcast out every week. And without him, I would not be able to do what I love doing, having memorable conversations with Permacard Members. Thank you. So, remember to like, share, and subscribe these Premier Card Memories conversations so neither you nor your friend can miss another episode. Thanks. The views expressed by guests on this podcast are their own, and the appearances on the program does not imply an endorsement of them or any entity they represent. While we will not add to statements made by our guests, we reserve the right to exclude statements or remarks that might be considered inflammatory. Thank you.